Hello, and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to install Citrix Workspace app in Windows 11. Let's dive into it. The first thing that we need to do is to open the web browser and type in the search field, Download Citrix Workspace. Click on the first link named Download Citrix Workspace app for Windows, Mac, and Chrome. You should end up in the website named citrix.com slash platform slash citrix dash workspace dash app. Click on Go to Downloads. On this page, you will find the latest versions of the Citrix Workspace app. You can download the current release, which is the newest version with newest features but can sometimes have minor bugs. Or can you go for the long-term service release which usually runs on a lower version but it's more stable regarding bugs? It's up to you to decide. I will go with the current release version of the Workspace app. Click on Citrix Workspace app 2405.10 for Windows and click on Download File. Click on Yes if a pop-up appears for the end user license agreement. Your download should then start automatically. Click on the installer to start the installation of the software. It usually takes a couple of minutes before it appears. If you receive an error that the installation prerequisites failed, it usually means that one or more of the following software requirements failed to install on your system. The first one is Microsoft Edge WebView version 117 or later. The second one is .NET Framework 4.8 and .NET Desktop Runtime 6.0.20 or later. And the last one is the latest version of Microsoft Visual C++ Redistributable. I will leave the system requirements and compatibility link in the description. Let's go back to our installation and click on Continue. Click on I agree and click on Continue again. On this screen, you can install additional add-ons. By installing app protection, you will not be able to take screen captures. And the second one, the Microsoft Teams plugin, optimizes your audio and video calling in Citrix. In my case, I won't be needing them, so I will leave it unchecked. The installation progress will take a couple of minutes to complete. After the installation, a pop-up will appear to enter your company's URL. Usually it starts with citrix.companyname.com. If you're not sure what the URL is, please contact your IT help desk to get that information. After adding the URL, a pop-up will appear to add your personal username and password. This information should also be provided by your IT help desk. During the password stage, usually you will receive a MFA authentication on your phone. It depends on your company if MFA is enabled or disabled. And there you go. You have successfully installed Citrix Workspace app on your Windows 11 machine. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Have a good day.